Hello everyone, I am the author Lauren A.R. Masterson aka Alice Liddell. I am also the co-editor of Cloud Orchid Publishing as well as the writer-in-chief. In addition to this, I am also a published author with Inksmith Publishing and I'm here today to tell you about all of my books that are available. It's quite a long list so let's get started. My first novel is Love of the Sea a fantasy fiction mermaid book published by Inksmith Publishing. My second novel is Tearing Down the Wall, a college romance novel published by Cloud Orchid Publishing. My third novel is a historical fiction called Geisha Hands, also published by Cloud Orchid Publishing. And this particular book is special because it is also fully illustrated with full color illustrations. My fourth novel, is a high school pregnancy romance novel published by Cloud Orchid Publishing titled Freya's Baby. My fifth and final novel is Freya's Baby Shattered, an alternative storyline to Freya's Baby where they lose the baby via miscarriage, and this is also published by Cloud Orchid Publishing. Next I have my poetry collections. The collections are a part of the Synesthesia series, and there are also two Synesthesia Poetry Collections that hopefully will be coming out later this year. Synesthesia Pandemic, which is obviously about the pandemic, COVID, quarantine, and all of the political and social things that have been happening in our environment. The first book in the Poetry Collection series is Synesthesia Darkness. This is published by Cloud Orchid Publishing and features poetry and artwork by me. The second poetry book in the Synesthesia series is Synesthesia Depression. This features poetry by me and photography by co-editor Graffiti Photographic, aka Brian Thompson, also published by Cloud Orchid Publishing. The third poetry book in the Synesthesia series is Synesthesia Experimental. This features poetry by me and photography by Graffiti Photographic, aka Brian Thompson. This is also published by Cloud Orchid Publishing. The fourth book in the Synesthesia poetry series is Synesthesia Nature. This features both poetry and photography by me, as well as most of the poetry in this particular book is in haiku form. This is also published by Cloud Orchid Publishing. The fifth book in the Synesthesia Poetry Collection series is Synesthesia Love, and this features poetry by me and photography by Graffiti Photographic, aka Brian Thompson, and is also published by Cloud Orchid. Next up, we have the art books. These art books combine artwork, poetry, and short stories by me, along with photography by Graffiti Photographic, aka Brian Thompson. These are all by Cloud Orchid Publishing. We have Swine Flu, Abandoned Bride, Oni, Whispers in the Snuffbox, Absent Ventriloquist, Mirror Mirror, Twig Noir, A Closer Look, Infidelity on a Sunny Afternoon, The Asylum, We the Fallen, and Pallid Out Recline, Waiting, Plunge the soul into the quick, and here now. We also have a very special edition called Crippled Inspiration, and this is a full retrospective of the Cloud Orchid Publishing crew and our journeys to the Ohio State Reformatory, also known as OSR. It is complete with all of the editorial fashion shoots that we did for various magazines, as well as interviews with the crew on our experiences with these fantastic journeys. Cloud Orchid Publishing also has a sister company called L'Art d'Obscurité. This is the direction that we took after we retired Cloud Orchid Magazine, back when we were a magazine publishing company and we would actively go to local events fashion shows, and feature designers in our magazines and write-up editorials. So now we have L'Art d'Obscurité, which is a magazine promoting dark art, fashion, and everything in between. There are currently three issues 
of the magazine and I have to be careful because the these two um, have nudity on the covers and yes they also include artistic nudes as well as some of the art books also include artistic nudes. All of the books that feature artistic nudes um, have a little indicator when you go to read the descriptions on Amazon. All of these books are available on Amazon. Some of them are also available on Kindle. Um, however, L'Art d'Obscurité, issue number three, is not available on Amazon. It's only available on MadCloud. I can't remember the reason for it, Brian told me once upon a time, but I don't remember, it's not really important. It's available on MadCloud, both in magazine form and on ebook form. Our last art book is Dreams and Flashbacks, featuring the beautiful model, Jocelyn Lark. And this one is also only available on MadCloud and not on Amazon, and it also features artistic nudes. This is done in a coffee table book style. However, we enjoyed the casual spiral binding so that you can actually lay the book flat in order to fully enjoy each picture and none of the pictures are stuck in the gutter when you turn the pages. So these are all of my creations. Many of them I have done in partnership with my best friend, Brian Thompson and all of the writing is by me. Um, this is about a decade worth of work in the making and we still have so much more content and we still have so many more books in the works and I have so many more books in the works, not just for Cloud Orchid Publishing, but also for Inksmith Publishing and for more publishers to come. So I'm very excited to share all these products with you. Please check the description below for Amazon links where you can find all of these wonderful products as well as the two MagCloud links. And I hope you enjoy some of these wonderful books. Bye-bye.